Yo, what's going on guys? I'm your boy here and today I'm bringing you guys another Far Cry 6 build video. Hope you guys are staying healthy and safe out there. And today I'm bringing you guys a um, stealth build where with this build we are using the Triador um, Supremo and I kind of changed up the build. I'm not just using the set that comes with it. So um, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into the build. So first we'll start off with the uh, Supremo. We are using once again the Triador. And this has the ability True Sight. It says use the Ol Olawa's power to mark enemies and cover. And combine with the uh, La Verita rifle shoot through walls. So um, this is probably one of the best like Supremos in the game. Just because of the fact you can shoot through walls. Specifically with the rifle that um, comes with this uh, Supremo and it's uh pretty cool and it does it's like pretty op as well because it, it one shots the enemies as well so yeah now we can start off with the gadgets we're using i'm using the healing syringe just to heal myself also a throwing axe a sticky emp grenade and also a smoke grenade i'm using a smoking grenade just in case um i need to run away i'll just throw it down and just run and i'm also of course using the emp grenade just to throw on the tanks to help disable those and also now we can go over to the mods. I'm using the stealth material which reduce movement noise. Also using sharpshooter, headshot kills, reward, bonus, supremo charge. And also we have the mod supremo extender. This improves the supremo duration. So um, that's basically it for the supremo. Now we can start off with the gear. So here's the gear we are using. Let's first start off with the um, head gear. I'm using the dark tech mask. This has digital camo. This slows down security camera and enemy auto turn detection speed. This is just in case, you know, um, so I could be really stealthy just in case I run into a camera or even a turret. So yeah, this is very helpful for the build. Now we go over to the chest gear. I'm using Olawa's heart. This has stealth material. This is also reducing movement noise. Now we go over to the light gear. We're using Oku's deliverance, which um, has the perk as above so below and this improves weapon damage to enemies below you and um this is good for whenever you're in a situation where you are um up on top of a roof and you activate the um supremo ability this is very good for that and now we go over to the foot gear i'm using the dark tech boots this has the perk assassin and this is improving our movement speed while crouch and now we go over to our wrist gear we're using the dark tech clubs and this has the um, perk gadget sniper throwing knives and throwing axes locked onto targets and this is helping us you know be much more accurate with our um throwing knives and throwing axes so yeah now we can start off with the weapons for the build so let's first start off with our first weapon we're using the sks rifle this is the best rifle in the game when it comes to like one shot uh, rifles that shoot single fire so yeah, we are using um, armor piercing rounds just so we can easily headshot the enemies with those um, helmets. And now we go to our other thing. We're using the large rectangular suppressor, also the ACOG, and we are using the cannon sight so we can shoot up um, like closer um, targets. And also we are using the three star laser pointer. Now for the mods, I am using Vir um, vampiric triada, which has the chance of healing on. Um, dealing damage and also trigger discipline which improves aim weapon damage now that's it for this weapon now we go over to our second weapon for this build so the second weapon for this build is the la verita which is the resolver weapon that um is good for the um supremo that we're using so this weapon is the one that's going to be shooting uh, we're going to be using to shoot through the walls so let's first start off with the mods it has Triada Mode, which Triada Mode um, can be used in combination with the Triada Door Supremo. This is what's, once again, basically helped me on shoot through walls. Now, for the other mods, we have Killer's Covenant. Landing a headshot in Triada Mode re um, refunds the round. Falcon's Eye increased the Triada's optic zoom level and also Scorched Earth. Disintegrated enemies leave a pool of sticky fire on the ground. And that's it for this weapon. Now we can move on to the next weapon. Now for the third weapon, I'm using the Rat 4 rocket launcher. Of course, just to deal with the tanks and helicopters and planes. 
so this weapon has um, the lock on mod which is helping me lock on to those vehicles also has gunslinger which improves the draw and holster speed nimble shooter which improves the movement speed while aiming and also trigger discipline which is improving our aim weapon damage and that's it for this weapon now we can move over to our pistol for this build so for the pistol for this build i'm using the 1911 just to switch it up a bit instead of me using a desert eagle or um, any of the other pistols so i have once again armor piercing rounds just so i can easily hatch out those enemies the large rectangular suppressor micro reflex sight and also the three star laser pointer and for the mods we have trigger discipline and also fast reload and um yeah that's basically it for the build uh the camp chef buff i'm using is still the gadget tier um gyoza this is um improving you know the amount of gadgets we can carry so um yeah that's basically it for the build hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys like comment subscribe make sure you guys stay safe out there and i'll see you guys in the next video